Apple's AR journey is expanding with the Apple Glasses, the next big thing after the Vision Pro. Although we're still waiting to get our hands on it, the buzz around its potential features and specs is intriguing. At WWDC 2023, Apple introduced the Vision Pro, showcasing its commitment to AR technology. Now they're gearing up for the Apple Glasses, expected to be a more affordable alternative to the Vision Pro. Are you struggling to explain your idea? Your audience is not getting what you're trying to say. An animated explainer video is a perfect solution for you. Explainer video simplifies any complex ideas through engaging animations, transitions, voiceovers, and meaningful scripts, which all together create a fun experience for any viewer. And here comes Ten Studio, a team of skilled professionals dedicated to creating engaging explainer videos. With over thousands completed projects, we have the expertise to create explainer videos that break down your message and connect with your audience. Get in touch with Ten Studio today. At the heart of this AR revolution is the recent unveiling of the Vision Pro at WWDC 2023. This move solidifies Apple's commitment to AR technology and lays the groundwork for the subsequent release of the Apple Glasses. While the Vision Pro is yet to hit the shelves, the buzz surrounding its potential features and specs is palpable, building anticipation for what the Apple Glasses might bring to the table. The key differentiator between the Vision Pro and the upcoming Apple Glasses lies in affordability. Apple seems keen on making AR technology more accessible to a broader audience, and the Apple Glasses are positioned as the vehicle for achieving this goal. By offering a more economical option, Apple hopes to entice developers to create a plethora of AR apps, expanding the usability and appeal of AR technology. Spec-wise, the Apple Glasses are expected to share some capabilities with the Vision Pro, but certain features may be omitted. Notably, VR capabilities, such as immersive virtual cinema experiences, might not be part of the package. Instead, the emphasis seems to be on integrating AR seamlessly into the user's real-world experience. This includes overlaying information on the physical environment, allowing users to watch videos or even mirroring their MacBook screen onto their AR glasses. One significant departure from the Vision Pro is the internal chipset. Given the form factor of glasses, it's impractical to house a powerful M2 or M3 chipset within the frames. Ming-Chi Ku suggests that the Apple Glasses will rely on an external device, likely the iPhone, for both processing power and battery support. With the remarkable advancements in Apple's chip series, particularly the A-series chips, this approach seems not only plausible, but also a strategic move to keep the glasses lightweight and user-friendly. Ku further indicates that before the Apple Glasses launch, we might witness an updated version of the Vision Pro. This could manifest as a Pro version and a more budget-friendly light version. This strategy allows Apple to gauge the market's response to the Vision Pro and adjust its approach accordingly. By offering a range of products, Apple aims to cater to a diverse consumer base and fine-tune its AR technology based on user feedback. Now, let's address the burning question on everyone's mind. The price. John Prosser's reports suggested a surprisingly low $500 price point, which raised eyebrows and speculation. While we don't entirely agree with this estimate, we do believe the Apple Glasses will find a middle ground, likely around the $1,000 mark. This pricing is rationalized by the reliance on the user's iPhone for processing power, eliminating the need for a built-in computer within the glasses. Additionally, the absence of certain VR features and the streamlined design contribute to potential cost savings. One noteworthy assurance for potential users is the availability of prescription lenses for Apple glasses. This addresses a significant concern for those dependent on prescription eyewear, ensuring that the AR experience is accessible to a broader demographic. As for the release date, the journey has been a roller coaster of speculations. Reports oscillate between full production swings and indefinite halts, with potential release years spanning from 2026 to 2027. It's apparent that Apple is taking a cautious approach, carefully evaluating the success of the Vision Pro and closely monitoring the competitive landscape. In conclusion, the Apple glasses represent the next frontier in AR technology, with Apple strategically navigating the market through the Vision Pro and gearing up for the more accessible Apple glasses.
the shift towards affordability, reliance on external processing, and a potential range of product offerings demonstrate Apple's commitment to making AR a mainstream technology. As we eagerly await further updates and an official release, the Apple glasses stand poised to redefine our interaction with augmented reality. What are your thoughts on the Apple glasses? How would you envision integrating this AR technology into your daily life? Share your insights and expectations. Thanks for watching our video. Like and share with your friends if you find this video helpful. Subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feed.